we are at the gathering place in Tulsa, Oklahoma. This is probably one of the most elaborate playgrounds we've ever seen. I was trying to get my kids to come here, or get an opportunity to come here with my kids when they were smaller. Because this is really, this looks like little, like you go up inside that Abigail or something, don't you? That's in crazy. But Abigail said that she is going to be an honorary kid today for me. Dude, that is weird, right? Why'd you get a smaller one? Like, you could go into a Oh, well, what, what fun would that be? Because Abby didn't have to go to school where they practiced rope climbing. <laughs> Get in there! <laughs> no, she's never got in. Okay, this is really weird being in here. This is wild. My daughter couldn't get in hers. Oh, man, it is weird. So my daughter was made, able to make it into one of the shorter ones. That was pretty neat to get in that thing. Parks like these are so neat. They're so creative and stuff. Well, this little skywalk goes all the way over here. That's the fake reeds. <laughs> they all placed specifically. So while we were in the park, somebody came up to us, one of the park staff and security, asked us to move our RV, our camper, and they told us that there was a parking lot for us to go park our car at somewhere else. And I think this is kind of like my frustration with places like this. There are these people that just kind of wander around and. Just sort of pick out things to make things a little bit difficult. He was telling us that the place was going to fill up and our camper was taking up too much spots. But the whole place was empty and there's no signs in the beginning of the park not to park there or that there was RV parking. So we drove out to try to find this parking and we couldn't find it. So then we just had to leave. So it was a little bit of a disappointing end there. So if you're traveling with an RV or camper, I do not know where there is uh, RV parking. Gracie, what are you doing? I'm trying to walk my dog. <laughs> She's pulling me to death. And there's no dogs allowed in the park. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, hope to catch you on the next one.